Self-service is a section of Blackboard that you can use to complete a variety of tasks. It can be used to choose classes, make payments, update personal information, as well as perform other functions. By the end of this tutorial, you will be able to find the Student Center, navigate the Student Center, understand your account, and make a payment online. Before you learn how to take care of your student finances, you will first need to know how to get to the right section of Blackboard. First, you will log in this website and sign in. Locate and click the self-service tab at the top of the page. Click the access self-service button and then click on the student center link. Now that you've found the Student Center, you can find out information about your account. For instance, you can see your class schedule in the first section, your account balance in the middle, account holds to your right, and your personal information at the bottom of the page. The Finances section is a very important part of the Student Center because it gives you information about your current balance, tentative future balance, and your dispersed pending financial aid. It also allows you to make a payment online without having to visit the Student Accounts Office to pay in person. Your current balance will be displayed in the light blue box labeled Account Summary within the Finances section. If there is an amount next to the words you owe now, there is a good chance that you will have a balance due for the current term that must be paid. You should always contact your Student Accounts Office if you are not aware of the amount or have any questions about it. This is an example of a student with a balance due now. Notice that the spring 2011 quarter future does not have charges. Sometimes a current balance comes up as future due even though charges are not applied for future terms. Your account may look different. Your future balance should be verified by a student accounts representative to make sure that your financial aid is appropriate and that your tuition matches your credits you intend to take when it's time for you to clear for the next quarter. The account activity link will show you all of your postings on your account, including the date and the amount of each item. You will be able to see financial aid and student account postings such as tuition and payments for many of the quarters that you have attended. This section can help you understand where your balance comes from. To get to account activity, click on the drop down box in the finances section. Making payments online is the fastest way to have payments applied to your account. If you know how to make payments online, you should have no trouble paying in self-service. The online payment types that are currently accepted are credit card, debit card, and ACH transfer or e-check. The method for applying each of these payment types is essentially the same. The only difference is the information that you need to provide. Step 1. Click on the Make a Payment button in the Student Center. Log in again using your Blackboard username and password. Click on the Make a Payment link on both screens. Type in the amount that you would like to pay towards your account balance and click Continue. Select your payment method. You can pay via credit, debit, or through your checking account. Fill in all the required fields for your payment. Click Submit Payment and you will then receive an email confirmation. If you have any questions about using the Student Center, your account, or about making payments, please contact your Student Accounts Office. Contact information for each campus is located on our Blackboard page under Contacts.